Hello, I'm Sherwood. And this is Merlin. We're the Pattersons, and we love traveling in our new camp 2020 Tab 400 that we've named Page 2. Page was our first miniature dachshund several years ago, and while we miss her, we've named our pontoon boat Miss Page, and now we've called our Tab 400 Page 2. Come along with us and explore as we show you where we go, what we do, and how we make it better. On this episode of Where We Go, we're going to visit Punderson State Park Campground in Northeast Ohio. It's only about a 45 minute drive from our house, so it makes a great weekend getaway. The park is 741 acres with a 150 acre lake, a couple of smaller lakes connected by streams. There's 11 miles of hiking trails, a disc golf course, a swimming beach at the big lake, 167 campsites with 20 amps electric, 20 sites with full hookups that have 30 and 50 amps electric. The shower houses have flush toilets and hot showers. And there's a dump station with two dump positions. The park also features an 18-hole championship-rated public golf course with a pro shop and snack bar. There's also volleyball, basketball courts, horseshoes, and playgrounds in various day-use areas. And now we're going to turn the power back on. We have green lights on the surge protector. We've got the cable laid out and plugged in. We'll go inside and make sure that all the electricity is working properly. The best way, in my opinion, to check and make sure the AC is working correctly and to get the AC to all of the plugs in the trailer is to turn on the inverter. When you turn on the inverter, you'll see that the light first turns green, then it turns yellow. Yellow means that it's sensing the AC from the campground, and the plugs are hot, but the inverter is not being used. Now we've got AC in all the different plugs, 12 volts in the 12 volt plugs. Good news for the day, here comes lunch. All set up at camp for our first day of camping. Now it's time for lunch. A little sandwich, some iced tea, and some chips. So here we are doing one of the things that we always like to do when we first get to a campsite. Go around, look at everything. Scope it out, see who's here. See which site we like the best. And then we also make note of what sites we like. And we make uh, reservations the next time on the better site. We also are on the lookout for other cab trailers.
So what do you do when you're camping in the rain? You go out antique shopping. Beautiful Ohio summer weather. Also, when you're out antique shopping and you drive past a chocolate store, you gotta make a stop there too. Bought a few items to eat and snack on on the way home, and we were some happy campers. Even though we had a little rain on the weekend, we still had a fun time. We got out into the neighborhood, saw some of the sights, bought some candy. What more could you ask for? We had fun. Glad you were with us on this episode of Where We Go. You can also look at some of our other YouTube videos, which feature how we make things better. Fixing things, adding things, modifying things. And of course, there's also what we do and where we go. That YouTube channel is tab 400, page 2. Thanks for being with us. Like the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and ring the bell so you get notifications. We'll see you next time on Where We Go.